Hello, my name is Jan Westerholm from Åbo Academy University. I'm here to tell you about my course called Parallel Programming. I hope you will find my course interesting and join the course. Now, why is parallel programming interesting? And what can you do with parallel programming? When you write a piece of code, it usually runs on one CPU core. But today, almost all computers are capable of so much more. Computers have at least two or four, and in many cases, even eight CPU cores. In parallel programming, you will learn how to put all those CPU cores on your computer to work. Your programs will be much faster and your programs will respond more quickly to user input. But in my course, I will go one step further. You may have heard that a joint European world level supercomputer called LUMI is being installed in Northern Finland. How do we program supercomputers where hundreds of thousands of CPU cores are available? Well, that's what we do next in my course on parallel programming. We write programs for supercomputers. Programs which take, say, one month to run on your desktop can now run in 10 seconds. Finally, there's new hardware available for computations. They are called graphics processors or GPUs. In parallel programming, we will be using uh, GPUs to make your programs hundreds of times faster than on CPU cores. We use the industry standard for GPU programming, which is the NVIDIA programming environment called CUDA. How do you pass the course on parallel programming? To pass this course, you will be asked to solve the same problem three times. First on one machine, then on a small supercomputer, and finally on a GPU. In the program assignment, we compare a real distribution of galaxies in the universe to a hypothetical even distribution and as a result, we will conclude that the universe may contain dark matter. Thank you for your attention. I hope I have whetted your appetite for parallel programming. And I hope to see you in my course on parallel programming.